Today we will talk about the local anesthesia in pediatric dentistry. We have uh, two types of uh, anesthesia. The first one, the topical anesthesia and the local anesthesia. Topical anesthesia uh, will contain a material such as gels or uh, the solutions that apply to the, the mucosa to anesthetize the surface of the mucosa in order to provide the local anesthesia. The other type is the local anesthesia. It's a solution that is administrated by, in, by means of uh, injection uh, to the nerves that supply the tooth that, and the surrounding tissue. In, in the case of the topical anesthesia, we apply a small amount of the gel on a cotton roll and apply it for about two minutes in the area where we will provide the injection. Waiting for two minutes will provide us about two millimeter thickness of anesthesia for the mucosa. This will reduce the pain of needle penetration. In the local anesthesia, we have dental syringe, the cartilage, and the um, uh, the needle, um, the cartilage. We in the cartilage we can see the um, the name of the anesthetic solution uh, and its concentration and the concentration of epinephrine. Uh, regarding the needle, we have three sizes of the needle. We have the ultra short and the short and the long. In the long uh, needle, we don't use it uh, in uh, pediatric dentistry. Uh, in case of ultra short needle, it's about uh, 10 millimeter length. Uh, we use it in case of uh, infiltration and in the case of uh, intraosseous uh, injection. The short one, we use it uh, in, in case of ID block for uh, small uh, kids. The, in, in case of uh, uh, older patient, we may use the uh, long needle.